it's so fucking easy that a fucking five-year-old could figure out that the earth is fucking flat. Who the fuck is this asshole? Please refrain from using any further obscenities in the presence of these people. What? You think you're fucking spinning a thousand miles an hour, but oh, you can't feel nothing. Yep. Oh, everything's fucking spinning, so nothing's spinning. Yeah, that, that makes a lot of sense. Mr. Dumbass, I can bring a lot to Dumbass and Dumbass. I'm a go-getter. Dumbass material all the way. Yeah, fucking gravity. Good one. Hold magically holds fucking trillions and trillions of gallons of water to a spinning fucking ball. Yeah, good one. I've come back from the future to tell you something really important. What is it? You're an idiot. Like I said, I used to be a globe tart. I used to believe this fucking horse shit too until I actually fucking thought of it. You got a lot of problems, don't you? Jesus Christ. You fucking globe tards are so programmed. I mean, it's, it's just ridiculous. So what can I do for you, Peter? Well, Joe, I need to talk to you about something kind of personal. Shoot. Well, you know, I took this test, and uh, it sort of turns out that I'm technically mentally retarded. You think you're living, uh, clinging to the side of a fucking ball? I mean, who's the fucking, who's the crazy one? That's definitely you. Do you fucking actually think the uh, sun is 93 million fucking miles away? Are you that goddamn dumb? I'm obnoxious and disliked, you know that, sir. Yes, I know. I'm obnoxious and disliked, you know that, sir. Yes, I do. He's obnoxious and disliked, did you know that? So how could the sun or the moon go inside the fucking clouds? How could the sun go inside the clouds if it's 93 million miles away? If the sun was actually 93 million miles away, it would be a fucking beam of light, just like a uh, spotlight or a laser beam or whatever, and it'd be 93 million fucking miles long. I don't care what every single person on Earth says. You're hilarious. If you actually could think with your fucking own brain, like I said, you could easily figure this shit out, right? It's real fucking simple, right? Airplanes, prove the fucking Earth is flat. Yep, that's right. I just fucking said it. Soon we'll be able to look back on this and laugh. <laughs> because if you actually lived on a fucking ball, a fucking spinning globe tarred ball, you are ugly when you're angry. You would actually have to literally look down, out the window and down to see the fucking horizon. But you, you don't. You look out and it's eye level right outside the airplane. Hi, Cleveland. Hi, Joseph. What's the story? Morning glory. What's the word? Hummingbird. Have you heard Peter Griffin is slow? Not one fucking shred of evidence. None. None. That prove you fucking on a spinning goddamn ball. He'll drive a car. Can he drink at a bar? Will they let him have kids? Is his life on the Hello, Mrs. Griffin. It's your neighbor Quagmire. Now that Peter's mental, you probably have some needs. Words have fucking meaning, right? It's called sea level, not fucking sea curve. <laughs>